Taylor Swift recently revealed the details of her upcoming album remake, when she revealed Speak Now, Taylor's version, on Friday at her Nashville performance at Nissan Stadium, fireworks flew. She also lighted up the pedestrian bridge purple to match the record, the 33-year-old Swift said, there's a different reason that I'm really excited about this part of the set tonight, as she took the stage by herself for her solo songs. I have something I've been planning for a while, the revised Speak Now cover then surfaced, along with the additional captions, Taylor's version, and the release date of July 7, 2023, Swift then launched into Sparks Fly, one of the album's highlights. The news that my rendition of Speak Now will be released on July 7, just in time for July 9, Ikik, makes me feel very proud and happy. I wrote Speak Now for the first time entirely on my own between the ages of 18 and 20. Following the revelation, she posted a statement on social media that read, The songs that came from this time in my life were defined by their harsh honesty and censored diaristic confessions and wild wistfulness. Fans have been speculating for a while that Speak Now will be the next song to undergo re-recordings. Swift embraced all of her periods for her Grammy's Red Carpet Ensemble in February. She did, however, appear in a two-piece set in a deep dark blue by Roberto Cavalli a fashion designer she had previously collaborated with on the Speak Now album and who had made special looks for her era's tour. Fans also discovered other Easter eggs that alluded to her 2010 album after the debut of her Midnight's music videos in January. Fans caught her using the same guitar she used on her Speak Now tour in one place in the anti-hero music video. Meanwhile, back in October, when Swift was pictured on a stroll in New York City with her ex Joe Alwyn, some of her admirers speculated that the Tremont leather cross body bag she was carrying might have been an Easter egg. Taylor Swift launches Eras Tour with career spanning 44 song setlist in related video. The purse is one of the oldest in Swift's collection and debuted back in October 2010, the same month Swift released Speak Now, according to Taylor Swift Style, a fan run fashion blog. About the singer Fans have also pointed out that Swift's dress, namely her gray tights, is strikingly similar to outfits she wore during her Speak Now period. Swift claimed that although the private equity firm contacted her after their acquisition, she turned them down since Bronze Ithaca Holdings would continue to benefit off her previous music for many years.